curious underwater lost city called Mu has captivated the popular imagination for years. Believed to be sunk somewhere in the Pacific Ocean, many scientists dismiss the notion as sheer fantasy along the lines of the lost continent of Atlantis. But one Japanese marine geologist, Professor Masaki Kimura, believes he has found ruins in the waters off southern Japan that may, at least, have inspired these tales. I am getting close to the conviction that this is a mysterious civilization lost in a tectonic deformation in the Pacific Ocean. I think this city is not what Western people described as Mu, but Mu or Atlantis could be modeled on it. Kimura has worked for decades on proving that a group of extraordinary rock formations off Japan's southernmost island of Yonaguni is evidence of an ancient culture that disappeared into the Pacific after an earthquake 3,000 years ago. In 1985, tourists scuba diving noticed that some of the rocks seemed unnaturally smooth and formed what looked like a stone staircase close to island shores. After many further dives, Kimura says he found irregular rock formations over a square kilometer from its shores and even a road through rubble accumulated at the bottom of the ocean. In his mind, this is nothing less than evidence of man-made ruins. Judging by the design and the disposition of the ruins, the city must have looked just like an ancient Roman city. I can envisage that a triumphal arch-like statue stood on the left side of the Colosseum and a shrine over the hill. Kimura believes the city had a castle, a shrine, a triumphal arch, and Maui-like statues, and even a Colosseum. However, his claim has received a frosty reception from most other scientists, who say the ruins could be formed naturally through tidal and volcanic activity. They have also pointed out the lack of artifacts such as clay pots or weapons to prove humans lived among the rock formations at all. But that is not stopping Kimura looking for evidence to prove that these rocks really are the stuff of legend.